timestamps description section go and click on that and uh, enjoy and make your way to this point right here this little intersection uh, there is a, a waypoint there called offshore street you can make your way up and come south but once you get here you'll find this little building with abc on it there's a couple of bad guys inside so we'll make short work of them and once they're all clear just make your way to the back and you'll see these two containers on top of this like little unit and there's a shard inside this yonder box. Don't forget to press R so you get two. And uh, pick up anything else that's in there, of course. And there you go. Two points. For the next one, guys, head over to Westbrook. Uh, I did have to go to uh, uh, another playthrough to find this because I've already done it. But uh, just uh, zoom in until you get to uh, Dark Matter Waypoint. And there is an assault in progress just up to the left there. So if you've already done this, the car won't be there, and uh, probabilities are you've probably picked up the shards anyway. But there are two in total here. There's a couple of guys. Just uh, pinch them off. And there's two shards in total. One in the boot. Don't forget to press R so you get two. And uh, there's also one in the car as well. Um, but if you come here uh, later on and it's not you, that's because you finished the assault in progress and uh, the car will have disappeared on you. The next one is also um, another assault in progress and this time just head over to the uh, Santo Domingo area. And if you just zoom into this west corner, there's a little waypoint here called Red Dirt Bar. Just uh, head to that and then just make your way over to this position. And there's an assault in progress right there. If you've done the assault in progress, chances are that you've already picked up the shard. But maybe you didn't, so it's worth just double checking to see if it's still there. Just clear these mobs. Better! Losing soldiers here! Got the video and everything is so slow now. Okay, and once uh, once everybody's gone, just head over to the dead guy, and you'll see that there's a perk shot. Don't forget to press R instead of picking it up, and that way you will get two. There you go, up to nine. So for the next one, is actually two you head over to Santo Domingo, and if you zoom in onto the Arasaka Industrial Park waypoint, just make your way there. And uh, we want to head inside the building. Now there's a chance that these guys might aggro you, but uh, I'm pretty far forward now and they're not aggroing me. I don't know if I can't remember. There is some missions in here and uh, maybe they just don't want another beating from me. Uh, so don't forget to press R. The bug still works for me. And then make your way out and uh, back to the door once you came. You want to get into that little building right there. Just head round to the left side through this door, and there's another one right here. Press R, pick it up, and that'll take us from three to seven. Perfect. Hey guys, so for the next shot, just head down to the southeast corner of Santo Domingo, and there's a little house here with a shutter on the front of it. That is right there. Now, if the shutter is shut, there's something you need to do uh, to open it. If it is open, just head inside and double check see if you've picked up the shard i'll show you where the shard is now in a second if you head inside uh there should be a box there if the box is not there then you've already picked it up so just head down to this reported crime i'll show you where it is in a second need to get inside that little hut there head down to this position to this reported crime off your bike once we head inside, Regina will Pete, call. A nasty scrap broke out at a construction site. Dude responsible is heavily ironed. He'd be a great candidate for psycho study if you end this thing with him alive. Sending you the details. So she just sent you the details now for a cyber psycho sighting, which is right there, but it still hasn't opened up the door. What we need to do is go in the building, and this lady here, um, she has a shard on her. Just read it. And once you've read that, 
you can open up the mini map and you'll see that a reported crime has popped so we're going to make our way back up there you obviously you can go and do the cyber psycho stuff if you want but uh, i'm only here for the shard so just jump on the bike head back up to the original position we were just in and hopefully that shutter would be open Guys up front. You go inside. Shard is located in this box right here. Press R, of course, to pick up two. And uh, well, not pick up two, but you get two points for it. Um, from 1.04 and 1.06, that is. And that is that, guys. So uh, if that shutter is open, just double check to see if you picked up the shard, if you have grats, and uh, if you haven't, go and pick up that shard off that sleeping lady. Okay, see you on the next one. The next shard is located out in the Badlands, and if you have the waypoint, uh, Edgewood Farm is probably the easiest one to get to, but uh, Sunset Motel will get you there as well. You need to go roughly around halfway up this road here, so I'll take you from uh, the waypoint. Should pass, I think it's the third billboard right here. You know it's the right one because there's a wrecked car there. And once you're there, just stop and there's another car down the bottom. Just uh, dispose of that. And if you come around the corner, there is a perk shard. So don't forget to press R so you can get two and uh, pick up the other things as well and jump done. Okay, so the next shard is located in Haywood and just make your way down to this assault in progress right here. There is a waypoint here called Mega Building 2 and there's a couple of assaults in progress, but this is the one that we want right here. If it's not there for you and you've already completed it then there's probably a very high chance that you've already picked up the shard and uh, it might be worthwhile coming back but i think the shard is linked into completing the assault in progress it's very difficult to miss um, but it is you know, all the same so once you've cleared out the area they're pretty high level so be a little bit careful and you'll find there's a box here with a perk shard. Uh, press R to read it, obviously, and uh, that should complete the assault in progress as well. So, like I said, if the assault in progress is not there for you, you've probably already completed it, and it's probably not worthwhile checking out. So, the next shard is located in city center, and you need to make your way probably, it doesn't really matter. Um, go to Arasaka Tower, probably. It's a bit confusing to get to. But we just, if you just put a waypoint right there, um, you should eventually be able to make your way there. It, Skyline Republic is probably the better option because you could just come straight across. And once you get into this little area right here, um, it just is kind of open up. And um, there's a couple of landmarks around you. Pretty big intersection. And what you need to do is you need to get up on top of this unit. Uh, we'll just make our way up there. Now we don't have double jump. But uh, I think we'll be okay. And there it is. There's the body right there. There's uh, some components and uh, a perk shot. Don't forget to press R for learn. And uh, yeah, easy. 